are winners final JJ Paradox. Cuphead. Cuphead. Oh, I was gonna say, is he really? Is he really? Yeah, we're all recording. You're good to go. All right. So PT Falcon on battlefield. And this is good for both of them as a neutral starter. See if JJ slows down. He was definitely playing a little more deliberate. Than, oh, is this a bug oh, check? Oh, issue. Oh, okay. yeah, God. If they're rated to gentleman it, then... Oh, uh, he has the wrong tag. Oh, that makes sense. All right, <coughs> false start. What's your propulsion? JJ has tap jump? That's so weird. <laughs> Blood I think it's mind. for his IDJ. Oh, that makes sense. All right, back to Battlefield. See JJ going right in off the bat. We're seeing some more rolls away from JJ, which is really good. Um, first time I've seen Paradox actually kind of like chill, respect somebody. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, lately they've been going, Paradox still is up on him in sets. Um, he hasn't dropped any that I know about, but JJ's been frequently taking him to game, to oh, game five. every time it's, oh shit. <laughs> you do not want to fuck around with JJ. Yeah, you that's. You do not want to fuck around. Just like that, you see JJ, he actually started this game off a little slower than we're used to. Like, not, yeah, he, not. He just kept saying he wanted to go patient with it. I, he, I mean, and you need to with Paradox. Like, if you, if you have unchecked aggression, especially Paradox, when he's yeah. fucking Ivy Sword, yeah. he throws 18 leaps at you. <laughs> yeah, it's the whole forest. <laughs> <laughs> the whole forest. Yeah, that's exactly it. We'll see. Oh, I, oh that was a good spot. Slick. Honestly, I feel like he won't go Charizard unless he's like real high percent. That's just fodder for Captain. Yeah. Just get your ass juggled. Yeah, especially JJ knows how to frame trap those yeah. up smashes out of shield too. That was really slick. Oh, very My nice. God. That's so style. I like JJ playing a little bit of a runaway right here. That's good. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Oh my god, it's continuing. <laughs> Man, just the jokes. Oh, jealous. shit. I, just don't, I don't know, I feel like Charizard's death trap. It is, what Paradox likes to do with his switches sometimes is when someone has the edge on him with Ivy or something, even if it might be better in the matchup, he'll switch to Zard just to, just to mix him up. Yeah, and just it's, throw it off. It's, especially it's with a whole new game. It's a yeah. whole new game. Literally, you're like, oh, well, I guess I have to completely change everything I was doing. It's true, and especially with Raid, the rage that Charizard's got now. This is, yep, the yeah. back air away. It's really crazy you have to learn three matchups to play against all. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> and then if you learn PT, he's just going to pick back me or something. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. It's definitely, I was telling Corb, he's the final boss of our community. I agree. It's... It's going to be interesting this next season to see sort of the interplay between him, JJ, and Relentless now that he's back. But they are still the, the three that you got to you got to recognize. Relentless actually had a shoulder, uh, a shoulder surgery. Oh, he so did he will be that. out for a minute. Oh, that's I don't, too bad. He might make next season. I don't really know how the seasons work. I'm just kind of here. Well, as long as he gets better. I know he wants to be back in the scene, and that's like, yeah. As long as we see him every now and then, that's... Oh, oh. JJ instant, instant like disrespect. Yeah, that was the JJ. And that was a statement right there. And this is the one edge that you can kind of get on JJ. If you land something like that, you can get him playing more aggressive when he gets when he it's gets. It's like a team. challenge. Yep. It's like oh, it's like that. <laughs> and and normally JJ is so good at it that he can just overwhelm you with the pressure. But but against Paradox, when matched, it's like yeah. yeah. I, I like to commentate every time JJ plays, or like when I can. It's just fun watching him. Oh, hell yeah. I like that Peace Guy's pit. I could watch that shit all day. Yeah. He's got a he, solid pit. That gotten, was crazy. He's gotten so good so I've fast. I've never watched him or met him before, but <laughs> that was pretty dope. 
Yep, there was a time where he was, you know, you meet him in bracket, really nice kid, and clearly on the up and up, but, but you, you know, you'd, you'd have the edge on him, and then he just showed up one day, and he was a threat. <laughs> Still different. Yeah. Wait, who picked up D? It must have been Falcon. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Oh, I just feel like... What he may be prioritizing here is is uh, without the platforms, some of Ivy's really good cheese with up air confirms. Um, obviously, with no platforms, he can't he can't like nail those tech chases and stuff like that. So JJ's wanting to take away some of his offensive tools. I don't know. I just feel like if any character has, uh, I just never take anyone with ranged FD. Agreed. I just, I don't know. I just uh, apparently from my from my sets, I just I should never do that. There's some. Oh. I ooh, I hear what you're saying. That was nuts. Oh man, that's heartbreaking. I hear what you're saying, and I, I actually feel the same way. It's like if I don't get anything off of it, then I'm not going to prioritize it. But there are some matchups where it's like you take away some of their nasty confirms and stuff, and it can be worth it. Like it's just who you're banking on, really. It's been a weird game. A lot of shenanigans going on. Yeah, they're both. They're both playing like they're, they're both got a, basically an SD under their belt, and they're yeah. they're playing just off kilter. I've just seen some knees that he always hits, just kind of just yeah. kind of weird. And it might have something oh. to do with that crazy flare blitz we saw last game. That that gets inside your head. I might have. Maybe even us. Maybe even us. Wait, that is he gonna? Nope. See, now paradox. He's. He likes to use that flare blitz off stage when he thinks you're not respecting it. When he saves it for a while, it means he's waiting for you to stop respecting him off stage. Um, so far, this is actually JJ running this back very well. He's not playing impatiently. He's looking for his opportunities, but oh, oh. oh poor guy. <laughs> oh, poor guy. <laughs> yep. You gotta be careful where you go off stage. I won't. I won't label you with commentator curse, but it <laughs> might have happened. <laughs> no kidding. No kidding. Who's the loser of this kind of fight? That'd be Lil B, right? Loser's final? I think so, yeah. Yeah, because he's... Nice. Paradox going to switch it up? There's the pack, okay. He looked pretty He's feeling it. He looked pretty comfortable with his PT. He might just be looking for a change I of pace. I just don't know why if you won, you know? Uh, I'm with you on that. Like 2-0, like, right? Yeah, I don't, I don't understand the counter pick. He may be seeing something that uh, JJ's doing in neutral. You, JJ is adjusting. Like, yeah. we saw that in the last game especially, and he may it's, just want to stay ahead of the curve with that. It's just so mental. Like, oh, it's yeah. between them, and I just could never understand. That's true. This they, is like a rivalry that <laughs> I just can't get into. It really is. I just yeah. got to watch to see what happens. <laughs> I don't know if this is a statement as well. Like Possibly. That side B just started something. Yeah, we'll see. If they start playing wildly unsafe and just swinging on each other, then it's clear there's some beef. <laughs> yeah, there's beef. RB. <laughs> Yeah, I, I love how when you play against Pac-Man, there's just always a hydrant. You're always just getting slung around. Yep. Regardless. you got to respect it always. Wow, he just has Apple there. That's just so dope. He's so good with his fruits. Yeah, he, he seems to. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> That's whack. Pac-Man will oh do my such God. weird stuff like that to you. Cheese, man. He does kind of look like a, like a thing of cheese whenever he's nomming like that, doesn't <laughs> he? It does, a wheel of cheese. That's what JJ needs to do. Slow way down. Look for his spots. Oh god, that grab, man. It Wait, is. Can, it's so can active. Can just up B whenever he's under pressure? Is that a thing? I don't think <laughs> it has a good hitbox. He's doing box. it though. I think with somebody up so up close and personal, it kind of works. Right. Wow. That's a good point. You see that wall hop to yep. get out of the hydrant? Did he dodge with that? Oh yeah. Yeah. That JJ crazy. loves those. <laughs> nice spike though. He's got to go back to po uh, Pokemon training. Yeah, I don't. I don't think this was the right counter. This could be a like a momentum swing for JJ. That's true. Once he starts like, feeling himself, he's dangerous. These guys are robots. You give them oil, they're just gonna, like, you know. <laughs> That's a good way to put it. Yeah. 
Yeah, JJ is oh maybe God. the most momentum oh. based player. That was nuts. Oh, if he would hit the key, dude, I'm popping. <laughs> Paradox said, hold up, wait a minute. <laughs> what are you still here? I am the best pack man in Alaska. That's for damn sure. Yeah, that's <laughs> just probably true. I don't know about any packs up in Anchorage that are. It could be due to the lack of players, but, you know, you gotta take it where you get it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I just I just feel an energy here, you know? Yeah. It's hard it's hard to commentate. I don't even know. What <laughs> yeah, these two. Oh, are I've never different. seen that. That was cracked. They're both playing kinda strange. Like they're they're paying a lot of attention to what each other's are doing rather than working Themselves. a game plan. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like they aren't focusing on their game plan, they're focusing on each other. And that's why like things have this weird, like held up pace sometimes. Yeah, yeah. And now it's one to one. Like, yeah. That's just crazy. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. I need to stop talking. <laughs> Commentary. <laughs> I think we'll see a switch back to BT though, if I had to guess. And you know what? Sometimes that character switch mix up just to like throw him off mid set and then go back to your main. That's not a bad idea either. But I could see the logic, but at the same time, why lose that two zero momentum? Yeah. Know? Yeah. I'd never do that personally. <laughs> I'd but never do that. That's, that's because everything that is in my Jigglypuff just sucks, but. Yeah, I feel that. Small battlefield actually is scary against Pokemon Trader. These are early kill confirms with Ivysaur. song for this matchup, gotta be real. Yeah, I, I don't <laughs> even know what's going on. This is just soup. I, I thought I was tripping. I'm not gonna lie. I've never heard this ever. Fucking Simba's about to be born somewhere. Once again, just non-stop violence. Yeah, they're swinging on each other now. God, I think way too fast right now. Oh, he's, he's, he's just out there. Like, I never watched Dalton enough. I didn't even realize Flirt Ritz was that. It would go that far. Oh, I, don't, yeah. I don't know that much about it. Yeah, it's, it covers a lot, surprisingly. It's wildly unsafe. It reminds me of uh, what's this place? Uh, Wonderland? Is that it? Oh, yeah. Kind of reminds me of. Yeah, yeah. That's true. It's what's weird about Flare Blitz is that big explosion hitbox. He'll do it like right under the edge. What so did you? So it, yeah, the, the explosion will hit you, but if you shield it, it won't like send him into that free fall. It's it's cool what Dalton does with Flare Blitz. This man's definitely mastered this character, especially yeah. a Squirtle. You just see like, like who even does that right there? It's just like he just knows. Yep, get grabbed and 50%. <laughs> that's it. And that's what's so brutal about it. Is he'll like he'll stack 50%. Oh, is that why he went on FD? Oh, what he was doing right true. there? Yeah, that might be it. Because he was just hitting with those cheesy aerials. Yeah, this is. I'm surprised JJ. I, I like, guess so his up air sends him down. Is that what that is? It looks like it. A little bit. I don't know. I, oh. oh, on the on the last hitbox, that was a nut spike though. <laughs> oh, he just right in the face. <laughs> JJ's been, you know what, JJ's been trying to grab a lot this set too, and now that I see what he just did, that was conditioning. He was looking for a stock off of a spot dodge. God, the level these two play at. Yeah, I, I, I can't say much. I don't even know what's going on. You know, I'm just, I'm just here, <laughs> witnessing. God, I hope, not to sound biased, but I hope this goes like game five. I want to see a game. That would be pretty sick. Yeah, I want to see a game five here. These two are both playing pretty hot, especially now that they're swinging. They've, oh. they've got their game plan sort of set in stone, and they're sticking to it at this point. They're much more aggressive this game. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh is he making it? Nope. Wow. It's just like that. It's tough. <laughs> oh, shit. 
I feel like I blinked and it was over. <laughs> yeah. Like, I blinked once, Paradox winning, blink twice, JJ wins. Oh, okay. <laughs> These two are so dangerous off stage. Like, both of them have some of the most nuts ed edge guards I've ever seen. All spikes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All There's spikes. no like back airs or anything like that. It's just all spikes. I know. And Falcon Nair off stage is really good too. And JJ never uses it. He's hell like, no. no, you're going hell straight no. to hell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Every oh. time I play against him, I feel like I'm about to be putting a montage. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm like, God. <laughs> I think this is a paradox song choice. We want to hear some Sonic Adventure music. You know, I wonder if like they should they uh, rock paper scissors for music choice. Because, like, this this could be an unfair advantage. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> this is definitely some Paradox power music. That's actually good for Falcon, too. It's got that guitar. Oh, my God. Yep. Should have rocked with the scissors. You know what? He got... Oh, hurt. my God. Oh. Dirty freak. <laughs> <laughs> Would have been a nuts game. But... <laughs> Let me just charge you mid-stage. Your audio a little distorted. It seems like it, it's just so much attitude. I love this, this song. song. Yeah. <laughs> just not letting them touch the ground. Yeah. Because this happens. Oh. oh. Wow. Nice. Wow. That was a two frame. It starts off the Charizard. It's just. Him not being able to switch, or is this? He's just looking to pull his stock out. out. Yeah, you see him winging out these smash attacks yeah. and super armor. Yeah, that would be strange. He likes to do that when you get an early stock on him. When you get an early lead, to make sure you don't extra credit, he'll just wing out like up smashes with Zard because it's so fast. Oh wow! Oh, There's some real patience going on. They're just holding shield, confident they're not going to get grabbed. Oh. That was sick. That was so <laughs> cool. For no reason. <laughs> Every dare is just calculated with this man. It's so yeah. cool to watch. And he, he drifts with them afterwards, so they're safer than you think they should be. Like, yeah, you think you can just punish him out of shield, but he's already, like, just out of range. Gone. Yeah. Wow. Ooh, good read. MJ showed us earlier that thing. That thing. <laughs> that up smash was nice. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was kind of... That could kill early. <laughs> that was such a Start out twice. <laughs> <laughs> What's better than two feet? Try four. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's something MJ does, and Paradox will wing out smash attacks like that a couple times in a row oh, just oh. to mix you up. Almost a call out of the switch. Nuts. Nice. No, Yo, this... I swear, him switching between Pokemon saves him so much. That's true. He's still in trouble right now, though. He got to make this Zard do some serious work. He's got it. There it is. Nope. He hasn't closed out the stock yet. Gabby. Oh. Okay. Oh, this is Paradox Clutch Factor right here. This Hopefully. is for Game Five, right? Yeah. Yeah. This is Game Five. I see a few too many dash attacks here from JJ. That's not safe, my guy. He's feeling that angst, you know? Yeah, he is. He's starting that to win. This will be JJ's first win on Paradox if, if he clutches win. this. Yeah. Paradox is on, on the line here. Yeah. Hold his throne. And it's an even game again. Oh, God. Every time. <laughs> These two, yeah. They might meet again in Grand Finals. I mean, this is, this is Winner's Finals right now, so... Good way to cover that. <laughs> GH. Oh. Stop, dude, the anxiety. You're just an inch away from death right now. Actually was biting my nails, not even <laughs> kidding. I just didn't <laughs> want to do it into the mic. <laughs> <laughs> the expression's so real around here, folks. Yeah, no kidding. I think he spams up beat for me from here on out. Not even kidding. He should, yeah. Catch him in shield. Just throwing out arms. <laughs> I think this is, it ends soon. <laughs> one. Okay. It ends really soon. This is Zard Zard with full rage though. One smash attack and that's it. It ends really soon. Oh, oh, he baited out that air dodge. It was the right God, read. 180 won't kill. Yeah, Zard's heavy. I'm not feeling. Oh. <gasps> that's a bad throw. Okay. Okay. Can you cinch it up? 
No way. Oh, he was he was looking for a spicy oh, stage. Oh, nice. Great set. Great set.